Their crowds have turned out at a demonstration to support a family who are calling for an independent public inquiry into the death of a 29-year-old father of three. Kingsley Burrell died six years ago, just days after he was detained by police. On Wednesday, there were angry scenes outside Birmingham Crown Court when three officers who were accused of lying at an inquest into his death were found not guilty by a jury. Paul Aidy, Paul Greenfield and Mark Fannon had strongly denied the charges against them. Raju Popat reports from the rally. The death of Kingsley Burrell has had a huge impact on people here in Birmingham. He died six years ago, four days after being detained by West Midlands police. He was found unresponsive in a seclusion room in a mental health unit. An inquest found that prolonged restraint had been a factor in his death, as well as failure to provide basic medical attention. Kingsley's family have been demanding to know exactly what happened to him on that day in March 2011. Although we want to get on with life, it's impossible for, not even me, for any family to get on with their life. Because at the end of the day, if there's no closure, you cannot get on with your life. Definitely not over. We're waiting for the public inquiry. We asked for that over two years ago. We've been waiting for um, the nature to take its course. And we're here two years later. And we're asking, and we're actually demanding for that report to be released and a public inquiry into the death of Kingsley Burrell. On Wednesday, there were angry scenes outside Birmingham Crown Court when three officers were cleared of perjury and perverting the course of justice. The prosecution had alleged that they told repeated lies at an initial inquiry and at an inquest about a covering that was placed over Kingsley's face. The three-week trial was told that numerous witnesses saw that his face was covered with either a towel, sheet or blanket when he was placed in the seclusion room of the Oliaster Mental Health Unit. The officers said they did not see a covering. Well, they were all found not guilty of the charges against them. Family spokesman and campaigner Desmond Jadu organised today's rally and he has organised other protests across the West Midlands. It's all about raising the awareness of the continued injustice of the Kings of Burrell campaign. Um, the family of what they're going through, his friends, his children. People want, want answers and we're still short of those answers that we seek. The Independent Police Complaints Commission has said that three officers had cases to answer for gross misconduct. The family say they won't rest until they have the answers they need. Their fight for justice continues. That's Rajiv Popat with that report. A jury has